Hi everyone, we are back, Nevada Virtual Academy, working on one more proficiency exam problem. Algebra, geometry, most likely geometry, but simple geometry. Um, and you should be able to get a maximum score on a similar type of problem. 20. In the diagram below, points A, C and D are on a circle O. What is the measure of angle A, B, C? Okay, how should we solve this problem? Well, let's start with the given facts. The given facts, and by the way, just looking at your answers here, A, B, C, D, is telling you that the measure of angle A, D, C, which is this angle here, could be 25, 50, 100, 200. But just comparing A, O, C, which is this angle here, right, with your A, D, C, what can you guys tell me? What, I mean, what can you observe without knowing any math in regard to the two angles. What is so visible? Don't you agree that, you know, comparing the two angles, in no ways angle ADC could be greater than angle AOC. And knowing that, I can eliminate C and D. They're not good. The two angles cannot be congruent, that's obvious. And angle ADC, the red one, right? cannot be bigger than the than the other one and that's what gives you the chance to eliminate two of the answers and work on the rest right so you have 50 percent chance now if you have no clue what to do next on uh, getting the right answer very good angle a o c angle a o c is what kind of angle central angle right central angle for a central angle we know that the measure of this AOC is always equal to the measure of the intercepted arc which in this case is arc AC and for you guys to see that better that's the arc I'm talking about so my angle AOC has that measure which is what in this case 100 degrees good that's for the central angles let's talk about angle ADC angle ADC is what kind of angle on geometry that's an inscribed inscribed angle knowing that this is an inscribed angle you guys should remember that the measure of an inscribed angle in this case the measure of ADC is going to be half of the intercepted arc half the measure of arc AC well that's half of what half of 100 degrees right which gives you the measure of angle ADC as being nothing else but 50 degrees what is the answer B are you done well at least with this problem you should be done and if you have a similar problem, solve it the same way. Remember this, um, you know, fact, this rules here, right? Central angles, inscribed angles. And we also talked about in a previous lesson of, um, you know, external angles. Uh, think about secants to a circle, right? Tangent to a circle and all the other related topics. So we're done for this one. Follow the steps and you will be a happy one. Thank you guys. I will see you soon.